job, guys. YouTube, welcome back to another episode of Coastal GX. I'm Robert, and once again, we're gonna promise to get up, get out, and do something. Today, we're out here at, in the bay. As you can see, there's the Isabella Causeway, and we're on boat, uh, aboard this, uh, this boat uh, from Danny B's Charters, and we're gonna be doing a little fishing. I've never been on one of these uh, things out here, one of these little uh, charters, and I wanted to I wanted to test it out. 25 bucks gets you a boat ride. I brought nothing with me. I didn't bring any tackle, I didn't bring any bait. And I'm gonna see how it is to uh, come out here and uh, fish on one of these charters. Came out here with my brothers, my brother and my friends over here, Jesse's, the two Jesse's. Already met the captain. Everybody seems to be very friendly out here, but we're going to give it a test and we'll let you know how it goes. What we go for is whiting, smarty medium sized fish, they're real good eating, uh, sand trout of course, but you never know, you could run into a shark, light drum, red drum, anything, puffer fish. Uh, people come on the boat, um, some of them don't know how to fish most of the time, yeah. so I teach them how to fish and I show them, I show them the works around here. And I take off the fish for them, string them up for them, and if they want them to get them for late at the end of the trip, I do. We do charge a fee, fifty cents a fish for like white, three dollars for a red fish, maybe five dollars for a shark, stuff like that. And then from there, they just take it out to a restaurant, they get it cooked out here. Well, and I gotta ask you, somebody, you've never come over here, you've never been fishing, you're you're new to the valley, but you want to have the experience. Why do you think this is the right thing for them to do? Uh, for $25, it goes a long way. Uh, if you go fishing on your own, $25 doesn't pour the shrimp, basically. All right, and for $25, you get the tackle here, you get the bait, plus you get our service. $25, you can't beat it. What do you think would benefit most of this trip? I think the customer. Yeah, because, uh, I mean, it comes with, like I said, everything to tackle the bait, plus the gas to get out there and uh, sightseeing as well. I mean, you normally just don't go for the fishing, you'll see dolphins as well, and uh, nature, of course. Yeah. Uh, just the scenery itself, you know. That's off, yes, sir. You know, what I, what I honestly feel for it is, uh, at least this is more for the novice fishermen. Yes. It's simple fishing, fishing on the bottom with dead shrimp, it doesn't come any simpler than that. Perfect for the kids, per perfect for first time fishermen. And uh, like I said, you know, the $25 you're gonna pay to get the boat right, to get to see the dolphins, to be just out here, you know, you can't beat that price. You know, try try to go somewhere else. You know, on a private charter, you know, look at four or five hundred bucks. You know, this is very affordable, and like I said, this is perfect for the kiddos, man. You can't beat it. You know, it, it what's priceless is you know to see these kids catch their first fish. You know, the faces they make, it, it sets that's gonna stay stuck in your head forever, man. Because you know that that's what excites me doing this. You know, people bringing people out catching their first fish, and uh, it, it brings joy to me, man. I, I, I dig it. Captain, what is? Tell me, what has got? I mean, you, you've been doing this for a long time. What has got to be some of the weirdest or the oddest thing that anyone has caught under your watch? Uh, we've got a boot one time. Then the second cast, he caught the other pair of boots. Then I got scared and I picked up the anchor and I left. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. what, what are we looking at right now? Where are we going? What, how do you uh, determine what's what's the best place for these people to catch? Well, right now we got to look at it. We got a pretty uh, slack tide. Uh, to be honest, fishing's been tough for the past ten days. Yeah. Uh, we've been catching, but we're not catching the numbers that we, we normally want to get. Uh, but right now we're on the side of the Picasso right here. This is called Thompson's Channel. And uh, we're going to be going to an area through the hump of the bridge, and uh, it's an area we call, we call a honeycomb. And uh, we're going to try to fish between 10 to 12 foot of water. 
and uh, lately that's where I've been getting some good bites there for Whiting and Centro. So hopefully it worked out. So here we are. If you can see this, I didn't bring my own gear. I didn't bring my own fishing rod. I bring. I didn't bring anything. And I want to do that on purpose. I want to do that intentionally to see just how it is to come out here and actually uh, see if we can catch something straight out of one of these uh, charters. 25 bucks, can't beat it. And I let it pretty much simply let it drop. It's all about the luck. So we got out here to this spot. Nothing, pretty much nothing was happening around here. One gentleman did catch a whiting, but that was about it. So the captain and the crew has decided maybe it's time to move somewhere else. Try our luck somewhere else. See how it goes. So it should be evident just by looking behind my shoulder here, this is the jetties and that is South Padre Island back there. So we came all around this side and uh, we're gonna start casting this way and see what happens. <laughs> oh, I got something here. There you go. Catch this one on camera. Here you go. Hey, and uh, how do we measure the, the whiting around here? We measure everything, but if it fits in a corn tortilla, it's a keeper. There you go. <laughs> the wind picked up suddenly, and it blew Junior's cap off into the water. Okay, we got Juan, the deckhand, trying to reel in Junior's cap to see if it happens. Oh, close. Man, he's trying. There's a six pack. You get it. No, no pressure, Juan. <laughs> Junior's like, there's a five ski for you, bro. You get it. <laughs> well, let me just say, I'm seeing if these guys can get that cap out of the water. Yeah, I don't know, but I think uh, the captain is actually turning around just to get Junior's cap. Can you believe that? I do. That's service, bro. I believe that. That is service. I deserve a great tent. <laughs> the hunt for Junior's cap. That's a great job, guys. That's the most exciting part of the video, bro. This is the first time you're out here? Yep. Uh, what do you think? Great. Well worth the time, money, experience, everything. How many did you catch, Tom? Don't lie, man. Uh, I kept five and ended up throwing four back. That's not bad. So what's the plan? What are you going to do with that? Eat it. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
We had a flock of admirers when we got back. Yeah, there you go. That's some good stringers, man. It's All that fun for about three hours. So if you've never fished in your life and you're at SPI, bring your fishing license and $25 with you. I'm not sponsored by Danny B, nor do I know anyone affiliated with a crew. I just wanted to get up, get out, and do something different. Please consider subscribing and liking our video. Your support means a lot to me.